Okay, here's my FX450. So I just snapped some photos and I'm gonna do a, a quick walk around and start. Um, then I'm gonna go ride uh, both the bikes for a while, both the Hoosbergs, and um, uh, to warm up the oil, then I'm gonna change the oil. So this one gets about 30 minutes every month. Um, at my buddy's place, I, I go out and I, I check his property lines. Um, so about 30 minutes a month on this one. Um, yeah, nothing. So, and the, the FE 390 over there in the background, that one gets a little bit less, but that's just ridden around here. This one, um, it is a lot of bikes. So it's an FX 450, and it, um, I would say, is in excellent shape. Uh, I, I don't know the hours. There's not an hour meter on these. Um, like there are on some of the other Hoosbergs. But if you told me it had 50 hours on it, I would say, yeah, that's about right. So I think that's probably accurate. Um, but there's no way to tell because there's not an hour meter. Um, but just based on the regular wear, you know, I would say less than 50 hours. Um, you know, it's uh, you have to judge for yourself, really. Uh, but everything's great. Um, Everything works right. I'll just do this quick video. And you know, the Hoosberg's the best thing about them is this pull strap, easy to do. One hand, and then you got your uh, filter, air filter right there. So you can do high water crossings. I'm not a water crossing guy, but you could if you wanted. And we'll go ahead and start it up here in a second. I got the GoPro on my on my chest mount. Makes it so easy. All right, so let's crank it up. Now we start like that. This one's running straight uh, coolant. Uh, well, 50-50 mix of coolant. It's not running engine ice or um, anything it's running coolant that one's got uh, ice in it so I topped it up and I uh, topped it up too much <laughs> but I didn't top this one up it's it's uh, full I mean they, sometimes they'll drop down a little bit but this one never has I mean, even in the summer I should ride it more I should clean it more I, I didn't clean the back tire I usually wipe it off with a microfiber um, and that's it dogs hang out uh, my these bikes the Hoosbergs hang out with my dogs so they get dusty yeah, so I never wash them I mean if I do I hose them with a garden hose and then uh, air compressor blow it out uh, everywhere all the crevices and then I wipe them down with a microfiber but I don't like anything put away wet so and these don't really get dirty like my 125 and <laughs> I get that thing really muddy but uh, you know it's a it's a different bike all right i mean they're great even just to look at they just they look so good yeah i'm gonna be i'm sure i'll be missing them uh, when they go but they're just not getting enough use and i'm trying to stay with the smaller bikes so it's probably better for me since i'm old now <laughs> later